Ooh. Ooh. That was good. Let's go. Yo, we're going to roll. Zero to death! Zero to death! Zero to death! Let's go! <laughs> yeah! Select to make your first pick. Skin it on down. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Skin it on down. Choose and pick the best one. Skin it on down. Five, four, three, two, one. Skin it on down. If if you like the video watching today, please like and subscribe to the channel, ring the bell, so you can stay up to date with the la most latest content. Also, if you want to support the channel, check out all the links in the description below. Before we get started, let you know, I hope you've enjoyed Halloween month. I'm glad y'all tuned in to watch Rivals of Ether 2, Rivals of Ether 1 game, online gameplay. Definitely need to do more of that when I can get a chance. I loved all the support for the last week because we got a lot of views and there was some old returning faces that came yesterday, and I can't thank y'all enough for that. Um, also, I know Halloween month is coming close to end. We will be doing a stream this Sunday, just so you know. So definitely stay on the lookout for that. And it should be really interesting. I don't know what game we're going to do yet, but it should be very interesting. Also, I know since a lot of people have been asking me, is Halloween, with Halloween month in, will I still be doing horror jam characters? Yes, I'll be trying to cover, if anything, all the horror jam characters. So don't worry. So when November comes, don't think it's going to be gone. <laughs> I know a lot of people are like, oh my god, Halloween month north, that means we're not characters. Like, no. All the characters are going to be going over, so don't worry about that. Also, um, Doefish to Nalzenor. <laughs> but with that being said, welcome back to another exciting episode of the Rivals of Ether Workshop Spotlight. I'm Yosa Jane, and today's character is Zephyr. Zephyr is made by Doefish. <laughs> Doefish is like, I'll drop 10 to do the character. I'm like, money talks, man. <laughs> He knows the joke behind that, but um, but if you actually do donate, uh, thank you so much, by the way, if you actually do. <laughs> For those who don't know who Zephyr is, Zephyr is the demon master of time himself from the hit series Castlevania. Um, he's one of the boss characters of the game. He's a demon with the mastery over time. The world, <laughs> if you would say. Um, a little bit of an origin story behind him. In Greek mythology, an emoi where the gods of the wind, Zephyr was known as the god of the west wind. Gentilest, gentilest of the of the wind. Zephyr was known for fracturing wind and messenger of spring. It is thought that he lived in the cave of Thrace. One of the surviving myths of Zephyrus features the um most prominently is that Hunk is it. Well, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna butcher all these. We'll say hi. Hi was a handsome athletic sparring prince. Zephyr fell in love with him and courted him. He did Apollo in the the competed boys of love, the boy for the boys love. Um, high, high chose Apollo, driving Zephyr's mad jealousy letter, catching Apollo. High throwing a disgust. Zephyr blew a gust of wind and striking the boy head while falling disgust. Now far as the Castlevania sir, he he showed up in Dawn of Sorrow. He showed a um, portrait of, Ru of the rain. Um, Dawn of Sorrow, which I think was his first appearance. Um, Soma encounters Zephyr. At the uh, Zephyr at the top of the cursed clock tower, who makes his introduction by demonstrating the, his time stop ability by destroying all the lamps in the room before Soma can even move. His main weakness lies in the fact that he stands and walks frequently without attacking, allowing the player to keep hitting him with any ranged soul or, or weapon. 
However, the player has to be careful not to attack Zephyr and as his aura around him, otherwise he'll stop Tom and slash them. Once defeated, Zephyr power of Tom will go out of control and cause him to age rapidly until becoming nothing but bone and dust. In the game library, it says Zephyr is a close friend with Chrono Mage, another character with the control over time. Um, and then the second entry, which I'll talk a little about, Castlevania Portrait of Ruin. Zephyr appears in the Portrait of Ruin as an optional boss, so most likely a secret boss, in a nested view. He retains all of his attacks from the Dawn of Sorrow, with only difference now he throws knives instead, which is a reference to Dio and a bunch of other things. So, shout out to Joseph Bazaar for those who know what that is. It's all wild, though! <laughs> Due to adding abilities, Protagonist game Jonathan and Charlotte, this time fights end easier overall. Couple 1000 blades cast usually enough to defeat him. Although Zephyr can still move while attack perform, he may bring out or in the meantime, allowing the stop time rush to slash the player choosing carefully where to cast his advice. Boom. This is Zephyr for you. Um, dope, now speaking of Dopefish, we have done other characters by Dopefish and Baz. And he's, he's also a subscriber channel, so shout out to that. We done M Vera. We did Ao Uni, which was was it last week or the week before last? And we did, and we did, and now we're doing Zephyr. So shout out to him. There's your shout out, man. <laughs> um, with that being said, let's get right into the color. And it seems like there is a lot of colors here. So default: Dark Lord, Dark Lord Reborn, Other Dark Lord, Dark Lord Junior, Fierce Lord, Mirror Lord, Old Hero, Die Monster, Wannabe Slayer, Book. Bookworm, the first, the last, the return, off. Was that a Dio skin? <laughs> oh, Jota. Um, off brand two, Mito time, burn victim, Canadian, Spanish, goth, fox, hungy, KBD, KBD2, KBD3. I don't know the reference for these. Um, knife child, toy knife child, sword child, dog, dog stalker. Oh, that's awesome. Pixel Blood, Crimson Double. So we have like what? That, that has to be at least 31 costumes right there. And it looks like it's a voiceover thing too, so. Let's see what you can do though. Movement. Oh, he flies across. Ever so glad, Doc. Your time stops here. That's cool. Please tell me he actually stops time. Jab. Okay, one, two, three. One, two, three. So three hits, three button presses. Forward tilt. Down tilt. Whoa, his down tilt can go into that. Wait, did he just... He moved within warp time? Anyway. Down tilt goes in two parts. First part, and he pushes it again, does that. Which is like, um... Simon and, um, Richter from, um... Uh, from Smash Bros. was kind of cool. Up tilt. One button presses, two hits, though. Okay, Nair... There. Oh, that up air. Look at that up air. It looks like it's multi hit. Let me see. Ooh. It has a burst that didn't love that. Forward smash. Huh. Down smash. That's a crazy up smash. He flips first before he does it. That's kind of crazy. Anyway, new special. There's a knife. Four special. Oh, so forward special is basically a dash. Okay, down special. A special. Whoa. That doesn't really explain his mirror scenario, though. I'll suppose it's kind of cool. Him jumping off the clock is cool. You cancel it. Block, I see. Maybe I hit A and B. There's got to be a way for him to stop Tom missing him. I don't know about stopping Tom. I don't know. I'll sp Oh, so neutral special in the air does that. Forward special. Down special. Ah, that's how you stop time. So, wait, if you hold buttons, does that. 
Oh, tapping versus holding does different things. Oh, okay. So if you hold four special, it stops time. If you hold neutral special, it does three. If you hold up special, it does two. And if you hold down special, it stops time that way. That's cool. And then dash attack does his multi attack. Oh! So when you hit neutral spell. Wait, so what determines. How did I do it that one time? That kind of threw me off. There was time I did forward special and he stopped time, and the other time he didn't. Oh, during hit stun, is that what it is? Oh, it's a hit stun thing. Hmm. Oh, so if you do a hit stun based move and then hit forward spot when it gets full, then you can stop time, I'm guessing. But let's see what Dope Fish has to say about this character. So I'm going to make sure I'm not missing anything. <clears throat> the time stopping thing, heralding from the clock tower in Castlevania, Dawn of Sorrow, Zephyr is is to mm, to avenge his friend Cromage. Zephyr is a flamboyant time stopping baddie who loves to throw knives. Now we have heard that before. Diuda. <laughs> he also combo heavy glass cannon who lacks raw speed, but. Has movement options, which you can tell by its forward spell and down special. And um, I love how the picture just shows knives <laughs> for all this move. That's funny. It's just unbalanced. That's funny. Cover approach. Forward special dashes briefly stops time if used while the opponent is in hit stun. Now we know. Make the essential tool extending combos and fly strings. Um, all three of his other specials those knives. While not particularly menacing, oh, there's a JoJo symbol. As projectile, can quickly rack up damage and use. Okay, strengths and weaknesses, oppressive combo game, many mobile options, excellent recovery, lack of raw skill, raw kill power, mediocre base speed, and lightweight. Okay, passive time stop. Zephyr rolls and parry function different than other characters. His roll moves through time, and air dodges are the same way too, or teleport. With no iframes, but it carries him farther than most characters, and he can attack out of it sooner. He can. Um, sack hit punching. Also, Zephyr time stop mirror fills up very quickly over time, or while dealing damage. Instantly fills successful parry. Okay, and while full, Zephyr can alter versions of his forward special and down special. Which is also kind of cool. And that's the alternate version you're talking about there. Um, new special knife throw. You can have do a single knife. Holding a special throws up three knives with a, a little bit longer startup. Different angles too while propelling up in the air. And backwards slightly. Um, hit parry while... Oh, I, I'm, I'm, my eyes are jumping. Don't buy me. It deals only 2% down with eat knife. Knife only deals 2% down. Descent, hit stun, and attack has a brief cooldown. And of course, on hit stun, you can do the uh, the world 2 in between, which is kind of cool. Force bash, time stop. Effort is most essential too. Normally, this attack sends Zephyr horizontally forward and can be canceled into mostly any attack, which we see. Um, preserving the momentum. But if you do it on hit stun, holding the special button briefly. It goes into the world though, which we're gonna call for now. And it'll, and it'll keep momentum of any move, and of course, the damage is up. Um, down special, which is the knife arc. This move, if you have the meter, it does the top stop time. If you do a regular, it does the knife throw, which is kind of cool. So, other to and then arcs, though, it may make it less likely for four knives to hit when the arc, the time stop version attack is situational, which we can see. Well, consuming mirror, you need to be charged. So, 
And then us special does the off the time clock and then throws two knives. Pre self explain. Now the tips about the character say starting strong attack while time stop decreases the duration of your time stop slightly and lands a strong attack in instantly. Still not bad idea to use time stop to kill the confirmed strong attack, but it has a penalty when you use slightly harder. Okay, so you can do it while doing this, but it seems like from what they're saying, there's a little bit of a, some lagging issue and stuff with it. Down tilt is a projectile. Wait, down tilt is a projectile immune back. Oh, it's immune to projectile. That's cool. Immune back Belmont kick slide. Low hitbox. Not only is that. But you can also press attack again to jump afterwards, leaving to the kick, which we already know about. I wonder if you could do da this into the dash. Oh, you can. That's kind of cool, too. Um, The bear, which is the back air. Off stage, it spikes. Oh, I didn't know. Only if the sweet spot of the lower end of the attack hurt box happens. So they're saying if you do this. It's going to be hard. But I can see what they mean. It's definitely going to be hard to do it. Um, continue to accelerate forward by charging forward strong. Whoa, I didn't know that. That's kind of cool for a charge attack. Up strong seems to have suck it for a due to the long starter, but it works well with his forward special. So I guess if you do... Give him a stand. Oh, that's smart. I didn't think about that. And credits, all sound voices are ripped from Castlevania, Dawn of Sorrow. Victory background are ripped from both Pain Overs and Copa's use of content aware fill. And Dracula con con conversation by Bale. Everything else, yours and truly me. Um, Tokyo Tom Tom Tokyo Tomare, which is the Jojo Bazaar thing he says after he does stop time. But... If you like what you're watching today, please like and subscribe. Let's see what you can do, though. Right now, I'm loving the whole time stop again. We need more time stopping characters in the game. Well, of course, we're going to start with Gio first, right? Yes. Of Brando. Okay. Okay. Are you serious? I don't know if I get combo in there with this character. Ooh! Excuse me, I was wrong. Hmm. Almost. Really? He got me in stop time? He's not ki kidding. His kill confirms are kind of hard to do. Ooh, that's clean. Can't really wave dash with the character because it's all the teleport moves. That makes sense.
Ooh. Woo! That was clean! Oh, the background looks really sick. I like that. I wonder if that's taken straight from the game. We're starting to get this character now. go Oh, that was my bad. I could have killed him. Okay, I see you. I see you, Zephyr. You're schmoovin'. Okay, I'm I'm starting to get this character. Hey, big buddy. Almost! Almost got zero to death! Kill confirmed. Well, oh, that was sick. I ain't make it, that's my fault. Woo! Clean, 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 clean. We'll do it one more before we do that match. Toy knife child, let's do it.
Didn't really kill him, that's crazy. Almost! I just died already. Hey, that knockback is kind of bad, though. I'm not going to lie. But I guess with all his options, I guess it shouldn't matter, I guess. It's like probably my only thing about the character is knockback. But his up air is really good. Woo! Almost. That's crazy. But I think the movement options why why he probably did that. I feel like I feel like one of his smash attacks should be like strong, at least a forward smash or something. But his character is crazy. But it's time, guys. For the big everybody. was good you know when you can do all that I don't think you need it really Okay, you may not need the strong attacks now. <laughs> now I'm doing it more and more. I don't think you need them. No! I wanted it back! I'm getting greedy, guys. Just end them. That'll kill him. Yeah, maybe his strong attacks don't need to be strong. I just realized this is Hasenki. I was trying to figure out what dog started character color screen on. It was Hasenki. Let's go. Oh, I almost had him. Wasn't expecting that. Ooh. Wait, this is for that indie game. The colors came now. I was going to get it, but I never bought it. If, if I'm correct. I can't think of the name of the indie game. That's where this color scheme comes from. I just realized that.
Ooh. Yo, that was good. I think I got one more match in me, guys. I think I got one more. Let's take us home. Give him the Crimson Devil. Let's go. Yo, zero to death. <laughs> oh, oh. Uh-uh. 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 Oh, that's my fault. There we go. I'll do one more. I'm feeling like doing one more. Yo, we're gonna roll. Now I'm satisfied. <laughs> Zephyr was a really good character. At first I was weird about the strongs not being that strong, but now that I've done it, been playing it more, I see why the smash attacks would be cut back. Um, don't fish, you did a good job. This is a really fun character. The Waldo! Definitely was one of those characters. I definitely recommend y'all download this character. This is really cool. I had a lot of fun playing this character. Now it's time to figure out what we're playing on Friday. That's the real question. This is Y'all can put y'all guesses in now at this point. <laughs> But, um, 
So far, this Horror Jam stuff has been really good. Shout out to all the creators and all the upcoming creators. Because I hear there's going to be over like 25 characters by the end of this. So this is going to be kind of crazy. So we will cover them for the next couple of weeks. Because we'll be doing three, three characters a week, obviously. Unless we do decide to do something crazy. But like and subscribe. Y'all stay salty. Y'all stay janky. And I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.